Hi, I'm Mitra Mitchell, and we are in my intimate studio, in my painting studio. I'm a professional figurative painter, and my work's represented by PS Gallery. I also teach drawing, design, painting, and art history at three colleges and universities in St. Louis. One of the things that I always make a point of doing is drawing with my students. Um, sharing personal experiences, um, being actively engaged, you know, with creating alongside of them. Um, I think that that's what students want. I, I certainly, when I was a student, that's what I wanted. I think a good teacher uses the whole classroom um, and you, you, a good teacher wants every student to walk away having an experience, having a rich experience. And that's um, what my goal is, you know, and especially even in art history. I mean, I have such a passion for teaching history. I try, for the most part, to make it a very visceral experience, to make it, I want other students to experience the images from more than just pictures. That's, I think, why I'm teaching. It's, it's, I see it as no different than making a painting. Every time I look at anything, I'm like seeing the world as a picture. So everything is very reflective in my life. Like nothing can just be like, nothing seems like happenstance. And I mean, that's sort of for me, like the role of being an artist that you just kind of take these seemingly like random mundane experiences or feelings and you kind of highlight them. It's never like I sat down and said, I'm gonna be a painter. I just always, that's just was always my way of communicating like the most complex um, feelings and actually like learning from it. This is a very like magical reality that happens. And you know, I've talked to other painters and not everybody, you know, feels this way. I mean, some painters do, some painters feel like there is um, magic, you know, there's, there's kind of a, the, t the painting tells you something, you know, because like you're controlling the painting, like I'm kind of telling it what to do right now, but it's also telling me something too, and then it kind of becomes its own thing. It's so very um, kind of intense when you think about it, like you're creating, the, the idea of like creating something.